Millions of teens use Instagram and Facebook, and now a lawsuit alleges their owner ignored internal reports about youth mental health. Our Be Mindful correspondent, Avery Martinez, joins us now live. Avery. Well, thanks, Stephanie. It's one of several legal actions facing Meta, including a congressional subcommittee focused on the teen mental health crisis, which has seen testimony from former Meta leaders. Meta knows the harm that kids experience on their platform and the executives know that their measures fail to address it. 42 attorneys general are involved, claiming Meta knew the concerns and did nothing. In recently unsealed documents, top Instagram executives raised concerns to Zuckerberg, specifically how features like beauty filters, which alter physical appearance digitally, might affect young users' self-image and mental health. Concerns about addiction, bullying, self-harm, and other health impacts were raised with possible solutions. The documents appear to show that Zuckerberg ignored or pushed aside these comments because the beauty filter was in such high demand. And while knowing about those concerns, ignored them. The Massachusetts AG who filed the suit claims these practices were designed to increase usage and profit the company. In a statement Meta sent earlier this week, the company claims they were disappointed that instead of working with companies on standards, the attorneys general have chosen this path. I spoke with folks downtown about their concerns over social media. I'm a 60-year-old woman and I still get um, envy on Instagram. And so if I'm getting it as someone who's developed some critical thinking skills, I can only imagine how a teenager is trying to grapple with uh, social media. Uh, I'm pretty sure it affects the children for sure and other people because I mean, it's like they don't get to go out and play anymore. They're always on the phone. Scrutiny over Meta's handling of social media and mental health concerns began with the whistleblower's allegations, which led to more investigations and testimony. There are actionable steps that Meta could take to address the problem. And three, they are deciding time and time again to not tackle these issues. Social media's intersection with mental health have been at the center of several legal actions recently. TikTok, YouTube, and other platforms are also facing questions about their policies and mental health. I'm Avery Martinez for ABC7. Thank you, Avery. We'll be updating the KVI News app with the latest updates on this particular case from Avery's report. And the ABC7 Newsroom is also sending breaking news alerts right to your phone.